Drag is holy. There has been an assault on the rights of drag performers in this country, and we must call out the hypocrisy and the injustice. When people think of the term church, one thing comes to mind. Most all have a presuppositional view of church, of what they grew up or what they saw. But church is actually a gathering of believers who come to worship Jesus Christ and our Father God. And that is the most important thing of the church, is the corporate worship of God. Sadly, what we're seeing here in America and possibly all over the world is just this nonsense of what church has become, this gathering of fools. But what we need to understand is what is the mission of the church? What is the church here for? And what is it to do? And for us, the beginning would be then, what is the mission of the church in the world? What are we supposed to be doing here? You might think that we're supposed to be providing entertainment for unbelievers. If you just took a look at the church superficially, you might think that we're supposed to have some kind of manipulative power on the levers of uh, authority and influence in the world if you looked at the political preoccupations of Christians and churches, but you would be wrong on both counts. The church exists in the world really with one mission, and that is defined for us in the Great Commission. Listen to the words of our Lord himself. He defines for us our responsibility, and I'll use three passages that are familiar with you. First, Matthew 28, 19, and 20. The command to his followers is this, Go, therefore, and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, teaching them to keep all that I commanded you. And behold, I am with you always, even to the end of the age." That is the Great Commission, to evangelize the nations, bringing them the gospel so that they believe, trust Christ, are baptized, start on the path of discipleship, which is defined as being obedient to all that the Lord has commanded. So we are in the business of proclaiming the gospel by which people are saved, become disciples, and live and serve in obedience to God. As you just heard, the mission of the church is for one thing and one thing only, is for that great commission for us to go out and preach the gospel to the world so that we may make disciples for Christ. And that is the church body, disciples gathering together, worshiping the Lord. Good to see you. Good to see you too. <laughs> are you at church? Yes, we are. Welcome to Saddleback, everybody. <laughs> Yes, this is Saddleback Church here in California, and this is a church where Rick Warren used to pastor, but you can see this is not about discipleship or making disciples or uh, going into the world with the gospel. It is about entertainment, and that is the problem with the church. It has become nothing more than a place to go become entertained. You might think that we're supposed to be providing entertainment for unbelievers, if you just took a look at the church superficially. Our Lord's words in Luke 24, verses 46 and 47, give us another angle on the same commission. He said to the disciples, it is written that Christ would suffer and rise again from the dead the third day, and that repentance for forgiveness of sins would be proclaimed in his name to all nations. There is our commission to proclaim repentance for forgiveness of sins in his name, the name of Christ. If R.C. Sproul was here today, you know exactly what he would say. What's wrong with you people? 